Oke, okay, bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, untuk presentation about my project conference at E3 2020, entitled uh, Extraction Dependency Based on Evolutionary Requirement Using Natural Language Processing. Uh, there's index, uh, introduction, research method, and also a conclusion. From introduction, uh, we got an preliminary studies. There was an entire step. Sarmosir and also Priyadi. Uh, from the state, uh, it talks about how how he can provide a continuation framework on the area of interdependency requirement. Uh, and Sarmosir introduced another method to build an interdependency requirement model based on the association of relation between requirement and classes. Priyadi introduced an interdependency requirement graph model from SRS document. So from that condition, from that continuation of previous studies, uh, the, the, we are proposed the extraction of dependency based on requirement for conditional and evolutionary dependency with natural language processing. This, this research method uh, got from uh, gathering a requirement statement and then identifying the dependency between requirement and then development of intermediate section methods and then modeling of interdependency requirement. From development of interdependency extraction methods, we got, uh, we make a mapping the requirement statement, preprocessing text, extracted clauses on the inter, inter, inter requirement statement, check the clauses of each clause in the requirement statement and then evaluate the clause in the requirement statement to be perfect sentence. Uh, so from veteran requirement statement, he states, I explain how the, con the collection of requirement statement contained in several several SRS document. There are two types of requirement statement in the SRS document, like a functional and non-functional requirement. The two requirements are used as data set for identifying interdependency between requirement in the SRS document. Uh, it is, uh, the mechanism for determining the dependency requirement are consists of one, how the requirement can affect another to another requirement. Two, uh, identify the interdependency requirement. Uh, there was a common apparent analysis and traceability relationship between those requirements. There are four either dependency requirement based on and the requirement one requires a requirement two to function or requirement one requires or doesn't not requirement two to operate XOR. There's another kind of interdependency between requirement one and requirement two, which can choose one of two requirement to function. Then part of is used to describe the relationship between complex and simple requirement, which is as which is are related to produce fraction of this complex requirement. From the development of the basic extraction method, uh, we are using a mapping the requirement statement and then preprocessing, then extract the clauses on the inter requirement statement, then check the clause of each class of each clause in the requirement statement and then evaluate the clause in the requirement statement to be a perfect sentences. From the mapping requirement statement, uh, it's necessary to template special requirement which is consists of functional and non-functional uh, requirement followed it in the following uh, requirement contained in the description sentence. Uh, and then the the functional requirement is used with minimum sentence that consists of subject pred and predicate, while non-functional requirement in the form of requirement of time service restriction, process development, and other standards. From the text processing, we implementing on every software requirement at text preparation stage. There are four main process. The following are example from requirement. There are sentence splitting, tokenization, postaging, and parsing. The sentence splitting is using the sentence tokenize. This function wraps a sentence to become a 
in one dimensional array so that it can be useful for another process. Tokenization has a role the breaking the text into smallest units in language processing or call it word pieces in the text document. Postaging this process carry out to find out the categorization of word classes such as nouns, verb, and adjective, and etc. And then parsing. This process evaluates the sentence with reference from 22. How it is made based on structure, whether it consists of the single or compound sentence by using the sign as, as a unit sentences. Then extract the clauses on interdependency inter requirement statement. Uh, the next step is to form the classes in the statement re between requirement by the minimum sentence consisting of criteria divided into subject, predicates, and an object. Rows and subject, predicates, and an object. And then check the clauses of each clause in the requirement statement. This process is carried out to see whether the clauses in the requirement still has a term or not. There was a term in this example. And then evaluate the classes in the requirement statement to be perfect sentences. This process is carried out to evaluate X clauses in the requirement statement by following perfect sentence or not. It is not appropriate, then it needs to be re-evaluated in this case. Uh, Non-functional seven has six clauses, six clauses consisting of KA1, KAP, KAC, KCA1, CA. K one C P one K C two A and then K C two B. These results are following reference by twenty two to minimize ambiguity in sentences that there are uh, that sentences to be get and part of. And then modeling of interdependency requirement. This step is presented with a stage which describe all the activities carried out in the research proposal based on the research content in the previous section the next stage is made to realize the framework that has been in the study step one analyze software development project in ETS and public repositories in the department information as a data set and then make a form of interdependency model between requirement and then grab union is a hypothesis as a method used to determine the interdependency requirement graph and then uh, after that an explanation of extent of the research process is carried based on functional and non-functional requirement and then as a preliminary preparation there is an example defining the decision extraction from srs which staging a requirement form for the type of interdependency this table uh, take a look about a uh, functional and non-functional requirement association with this extraction versus uh, n or xor and part of so the conclusion from this uh, research it can be concluded that with this method of development model interdependency models can be obtained among requirement attained which is our f1 f10 require f F two, and then F F three on SNS document. F one require F F two or F not F three on SNS eight document. F eight require F no F one X or F fifteen on SNS document, and also a non-functional seven A, F no seven B, and F no NF7C part of NF7 and SRS document, SRS2 document. So thank you for your attention. I want to close this video.